Hey, what's up guys? It's Jackson back with another video. So we've talked a lot on this channel about keeping your data safe and sound, you know, password managers, VPNs, the whole nine yards. But today we're diving into the dark side, the stuff that keeps you up at night, spyware. Specifically, we're talking about the top five most dangerous Android spyware tools out there in 2024. Now, before you hit that unsubscribe button thinking, nah, this is too techy for me. Trust me, this is important stuff. We're talking about tools that can literally watch your every move, steal your passwords, even listen to your conversations. Yeah, it's straight out of a spy movie, but unfortunately it's real. So whether you're rocking the latest Galaxy or a trusty Pixel, this video is for you. We're breaking down how these tools work, why they're so dangerous, and most importantly, what you can do to protect yourself. Let's get into it. First up, we've got MS Spy, and trust me, this one's not messing around. We're talking full-blown Big Brother level monitoring here. MS Spy digs its claws deep into your device, giving the attacker access to, well, pretty much everything. Think about it. Your text messages, gone. WhatsApp chats, history, browsing history, yeah, they see it all. And that's not even the scary part. MS Spy can even track your location in real time, meaning they know where you are 24-7. But it gets even creepier. Imagine someone listening in on your calls, reading your emails as you type them. That's the level of access MS Spy provides. All this happens silently in the background with no signs, no alerts, nothing. It's like having a ghost sitting right next to you watching your every move on your phone. And the worst part? Installing MS Spy is deceptively easy. A malicious link in an email, a compromised app from a dodgy app store, boom, you're infected. They even have versions for different operating systems, so even if you switch from Android, you might not be safe. Now, you might be thinking, okay, this is terrifying, but how do I even know if I have MSPy on my phone? Well, that's the tricky part. MSPy is designed to be stealthy, so it can be really hard to detect. But, there are a few red flags you can watch out for. Is your battery draining faster than usual? Is your phone running slower? Or are apps crashing more often? These could be signs that something fishy is going on in the background. And if you're really concerned, you can always try using a reputable anti-malware app to scan your device. Just make sure you download it from a trusted source like the Google Play Store. Remember with MS Pi, vigilance is key. Next up, we have EY Java, IG. Now, this one might not be as well known as MS Pi, but trust me, it's just as dangerous. In fact, you could say it's even more insidious because it hides behind a veil of seemingly legitimate features. Think of EY Java, IG, like a Swiss army knife of spyware. It's got all the usual suspects like call recording, GPS tracking, and access to your messages and photos. But then it throws in some extras that really make it stand out from the crowd. For starters, EY Java, IG, can remotely control your phone's camera and microphone. That's right, they can literally see and hear everything that's happening around you, turning your phone into a portable surveillance device. And if that wasn't creepy enough, EY Java, IG, can also steal your login credentials for various apps and websites. We're talking banking apps, social media accounts, email, you name it, they can grab it. So how do you know if you're infected with EY Java, IG? Well, it can be tricky, because like most spyware, it tries to stay hidden. Look out for unusual battery drain, unexplained data usage, or apps crashing more often than usual. And be extra careful about the apps you download, especially from third-party app stores. Now let's talk about Clav Gut. This one's known for being incredibly user-friendly, and I don't mean that in a good way. See, Clav Gut's developers have gone to great lengths to make their spyware accessible even to people with very little technical knowledge. Think of it like this. Imagine a spyware app so simple to use that anyone, even your tech-challenged uncle, could figure it out. That's Clav Gut. It's got a clean, intuitive interface that makes spying on someone as easy as using a social media app. But don't let the simplicity fool you. Clavgut is still incredibly powerful. It can track your location, record your calls, monitor your messages, and even control your phone's camera and microphone, all from a sleek and easy-to-navigate dashboard. And because it's so user-friendly, Clavgut is often marketed to jealous partners, overprotective parents, or even suspicious employers. They prey on people's insecurities and offer them a seemingly easy way to keep tabs on their loved ones or employees. But here's the thing. Using spyware, no matter how user-friendly it claims to be, is never okay. It's a massive invasion of privacy and can have serious legal consequences. If you're concerned about someone's safety or well-being, 
there are always better, more ethical ways to address the issue. Moving on, we've got FlexiSpy. And as the name suggests, this one's all about flexibility and comprehensive monitoring. We're talking next-level spying here, folks. FlexiSpeed takes things a step further than your average spyware, offering a whole arsenal of features that are downright unsettling. One of FlexiSpeed's standout, or should I say creep-out features, is its key logging capability. What that means is, every single keystroke you make, every password you type, every message you write, FlexiSpy captures it all. Imagine someone reading over your shoulder as you type in your most sensitive information. That's essentially what key logging allows. But FlexiSpy doesn't stop there. It also boasts a feature called ambient listening, which lets the attacker secretly activate your phone's microphone to listen in on conversations happening around you. Think you're having a private conversation? Think again. With FlexiSpy, there's a good chance someone is listening in. And for those who thought disappearing messages were the answer to secure communication, think again. FlexiSpy can even intercept and capture messages from apps that claim to offer end-to-end -end encryption, like WhatsApp and Telegram. The level of access and control FlexiSpy offers is truly alarming, making it a favorite among cybercriminals and those with malicious intent. It's a stark reminder that in the digital age, privacy is a precious commodity that needs to be fiercely protected. Last, but definitely not least, we have remote spy tools. Now this one's a bit different from the others because it's not just one single piece of software. It's more like a suite, a collection of different tools that all work together to give the attacker complete remote access to your device. Imagine this, your phone is just sitting there, minding its own business, when suddenly someone on the other side of the world starts controlling it as if it were in their own hands. That's the kind of power remote spy tools provides. They can read your messages, browse your photos and videos, even make calls and send texts, all without you ever knowing. It's like having a digital ghost haunting your device, silently watching and manipulating your every move. But here's the thing about remote spy tools that makes them particularly dangerous. They're often disguised as legitimate remote access software. You know, those apps that let you control your computer from your phone or vice versa. Yeah, remote spy tools can be disguised as those, making them even harder to detect. So, how can you protect yourself from this silent watcher? Well, the key is to be extremely cautious about the permissions you grant to apps, especially those that request remote access to your device. If something feels off, trust your gut and don't install it. So we've just gone through five of the scariest Android spyware tools out there, and honestly, it's enough to make you want to ditch your smartphone and live off the grid. But before you do that, remember, knowledge is power. By understanding the threats, you're already one step ahead in protecting yourself. Remember, always be mindful of the apps you download, especially from third-party sources. Pay attention to the permissions and app requests, and if something seems fishy, don't hesitate to hit that deny button. And hey, running a reputable anti-malware app on your phone isn't a bad idea either. Now this video just scratched the surface of the wild world of mobile security. In the next one, we'll be diving deep into the best practices to keep your phone and your data safe from these digital threats. Make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss it. Thanks for watching and stay safe out there.